We are back for the final time on uh, Retrofon 2024. And uh, if you're just tuning in, I'm Cyphering. Uh, we did Shinobi PS2 earlier. Uh, what was it? Uh, General Chaos. What else? Uh, what else did I do? Oh my god, I'm drawing a blank. Cobra Triangle, Double Dragon 3. And I feel like... Roll Russian attack for NES. <laughs> but yeah, we've come to the the final run, uh, my final run for uh, Retrothon, which uh, been having a blast. Uh, and it's funny that it says Tax Mania. I, I saw that in our schedule, and I said, you know, we'll just keep it. <laughs> this game can be taxing. And yes, just as Northern once said, you fail a glitch trick, you end up in jail. That has happened to me before on another marathon where I thought the the run was completely dead, but we survived. We came back. Uh, and came underestimate, or at least if I think we came underestimate, but yeah, it can happen. So with that said, we go ahead and, uh, get this ball rolling in three, two, one, go. As here's some legend from his dad about a bird, um, that has a gigantic egg and he wants to eat. So, whoop. Oh, that is a little scary. <laughs> Off the bat, almost about to go into a pit. Uh, all right, wait, wait, wait. All right, get our get our bearings. Yeah. Uh, am I going the right way? Actually, this don't feel right. Again, just like Shinobi PS2, didn't have a lot of time to to practice, so sort of remembering on the fly here. Get out of here. I'm gonna take a little bit of safe here. Come on. No! Okay, we're okay, we're okay. Okay. Eight percent no major audits. <laughs> Alright. At the start of the stage, if we do it right, you can like skip basically whole sections of the stage. Uh I did not get it there. As I was uh was moving when I wasn't supposed to be moving. But we're gonna see if we can try to get in on some of these later stages. So we're going taking the semi-intended route. We play this long enough as to end the route. Best maneuver in this game is the is Taz's spin. For the most part you're invincible against most things until you uh, get stopped like that. I think this is a boss fight here. Okay. We want to grab this bomb. Hopefully, I don't screw this up. Nice. And off to the factory. Oh, I didn't get the glitch, but this this is actually where I was when I uh, almost soft locked the game in the other marathon that I was in. But we luckily recovered. Uh, I gotta remember where to go. Gotta be careful when we pick up stuff because Taz likes to eat any and everything as soon as he picks it up. Ah! Come on. Alright. Gonna take this a little slow. I forget if you can fall through some of these sections like this here. Uh. Part of me thinks we should go down here. Can we go down? Yeah, that's right. Good. Yeah, let's see. See if we can get the, the skip this time. There it is. to just let that keep going or what but uh anyway we're taking a little detour get some food here oh wrong switch crap i think i'm about to die okay good Ooh. We, no, don't eat that fast spit it out 
Oh. Oh well. <laughs> All right. Well, we're back at the beginning, so that skip that we got earlier does not matter anymore. What we can do is we'll turn off a few of these switches, and we're gonna try to damage boost through some of these uh, little barriers here. It's sort of best to get hit by the electricity, or not electricity, the, the sentry bullet, because it does less damage. I think I can eat this, but uh, we need that to go. Yeah, so something like that. No, don't get shot again, please, for the love, don't get shot. Uh, eat that for safety. We're gonna wait. And then... Oh, yeah. Now, uh, let's see if we can get this next skip here. Oh. oh. Please land. All right, we'll take it easy here. I think this stage has my favorite music in the game. I know that's not saying much for people. <laughs> You've been paying attention to the soundtrack. Uh, you know, for some marathon safety. I think that's a one up, maybe. One of these is to continue. And I don't need that, but I'm just being greedy and hungry. Oh man, I wasn't supposed to be moving because that would have allowed me to skip this next part too. Yep, we didn't get it because I was moving. Oh well, so we gotta go and take the intended route again. This part, this stage can be rough because there's a lot of blind jumps. But if you, if you're taking those jumps and you take note of like the trees, the big stalks and like this tree behind me, you notice the, the trunks in the background. It'll give you an idea of where you can land when you are making the jumps. Oh. As long as I pay attention to that, I can sort of zoom across. Uh, not too much worry. Still some worry. But right there, there was no, uh, there was no uh, tree to look at in the background towards the tail end there. So yeah, we used the skip again to teleport up the tree a little bit. I don't know how helpful it was, but we'll take it. Yo! We got these rats shooting spears at us. fight Francis but again we got the spin which makes us pretty much invincible he can't touch us and that's it and blow our hot breath on him didn't know probably my tax could be as easy thank you sir <laughs> whatever I can do to help <laughs> All right, so now we have the the flowing river here Go ahead, grab that extra life. We'll ride this a little bit. Oops. Right, I think we should be in a good place where we can damage boost to the end. Let's go ahead and ride the, the river current. You know what? No, let me be safe. Grab that food because I, I forget how far, how much further we got to go. Alright, and now I think this is this is one of the hardest stages in the game for casual casual players. I'm probably gonna die a few times myself. Like the the turbo tunnel of this game. <laughs> if anybody's familiar with that term with when it comes to like battle toes. Ah I forgot. <laughs> Shoot. Alright, try again. Twice. Down. And keep speeding up. Speed up. Speed up again. And up. Down. Up. Down. Ow. Okay. 
Yeah, it'll eventually come back to me as we uh, keep making progress and keep hitting everything. Up, down, up, up, down, beat up, beat up, beat up, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, uh, speed up, hold down, uh, speed up, I hope. Oh, it was a slowdown crap. <laughs> Dang, darn it. Uh, okay. Losing all our lives, but we should have continues. Hoping. Okay, so up, down, <laughs> up again, down, speed up, and speed up, and up, down, up, down. I'm gonna take this a little slow. Up, down, speed up. Slow down. Next one's a slow down. Learned our lesson. Next one's a speed up. And avoid that. Speed up. Or not speed up. Up down. Up down. Up down. Speed up. And we're through. <laughs> Alright, after that stage, I feel like this is probably the hardest stage after that stage. This one, this level has some evil jumps, and it has some also uh, some traps like some areas that'll set you up to die. Get away from me! Right. So like over to the left, I think that elevator would drop you into a death pit. Uh, oh yeah, we keep going. And that old marathon safety, we're gonna take a little checkpoint there in case I miss, miss this jump up. Elevator action. <laughs> Alright, so I just wait for this little elevator to come back. There's sort of like a visual cue here. You know when to jump! <laughs> Get the jump. But that's why we got that checkpoint uh, that I got back there. Oh, we got five continues, that's good. Oh, uh, which that checkpoint didn't matter. <laughs> it's okay. So back to the beginning of the stage. Oh, darn it. That in the way. Come on. Come on. Get out of the way. Climb back up, we're going to hit our checkpoint again. Get a quick drink of some water. And wait. Wait it out here. Alright, nice. We got through. Take this elevator down. This falls. And one of those traps. Same again here. Uh, gotta wait for this elevator to come back. Spin to it just to make sure you uh, nail it. Now we got this springy elevator that we gotta, like, as we get to the very top, you wanna jump and force it, like, as far down as you can. Yeah, as, as it's going down, you know, keep jumping on it a little bit. And you'll get an idea that you're in a good spot, like, to clear, it, clear this area when we hit this, the, the black at the bottom there, so. Now in. And waiting for the elevator again. This is a tricky jump where we need to jump and spin a little bit in some parts. And we've cleared it. So now with that level out of the way, we're, it's, it's almost like home free now. Like we don't have to worry too much about the rest of the game. Uh, this part, same as before, we take some damage boosts across the, the river here. Uh, stop to get some food. I think there's a checkpoint here. 
on uh if we were, were so we're on easy actually um for this game if we were on hard the water they'd instant kill you nice that we got through that first try though but yeah on hard the water you'll, you'll die instantly if you go into it so you can't damage boost it costs uh we got a, a boss fight coming up where you see these little mini Venus flytrap type plants uh, attacking us. Uh, we're about to now deal with a, a big, a big version. Oops, did that? I don't know if I even hit with that. This sort of kills it quicker, I feel like. But in case we don't have it, we can just use our, our spin too. And that's it. Oops, I gotta stop jumping. We want to do the warps and stuff. Um, but that's okay. We're now on the, the final stretch of levels for this. We have to go through like this, uh, we'll call it a temple, I guess. We gotta go through this temple. It's a bit of a maze. Work our way inside to get uh, on top of it and over. Once we're through that first initial temple, now we get to this next one. You can follow the Taz statues. There's a few that you see that point in directions. They give you like basically the direction that you need to go in. And then that's it. I was gonna try to skip, but I think this is one of those levels where you can get stuck in the wall. I wanna be I didn't didn't want to risk it. <laughs> Taking it the normal way. That's are so annoying in this game. Uh, I think we're going the right way. You know, I'll hit that checkpoint. paid attention is at least the beginning of it is the same as like two levels ago and you take the exact same pathing up until a certain point but yeah we, we went inside the temple over again with the past statue pointing the way and climb up the top here again go inside but unlike the last time where like right about here we we went down and exit the level here you gotta go to the right and that statue actually is pointing the wrong way you now gotta work your way <clears throat> to the left drop into here and get greeted by shadow tasks and just tornado him to death and then from there, now we're on to the, uh, the final, 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 final level. Where we're now about to fight the big papa or mama bird for that egg. We want to, we want the, sounds so bad. We want, we want that egg and we want to have us a nice scrambled breakfast. We don't care about the, the mama's feelings. our tornado to avoid the attacks the mama tries to call her eyes out and then that's it that's time uh, 
uh, do this, uh, does this game and other task games on the Genesis use the same engine? I s assume so, because Taz in Escape from Mars plays very much like this. Though so it has, you know, some upgraded stuff with it. Uh, I never, I don't think I beat that game. I forget if I did or not. I actually don't like it as much as I do this one. So I play this one a whole lot more than Taz Escape from Mars. But maybe I need to revisit it. <clears throat> And yeah, just as you all see, uh, got to the egg, it hatched, and now the bird that came out thinks we're its mama and won't leave us alone. Thank you all for the GGs. Again, that will conclude Retrothon for me, but of course that won't conclude Retrothon for you. So continue to stick around, hang out with us, and look forward to some Altered Beasts as part of this uh, Sega block uh, continuing here with ZG. And thank you. Thank you for tuning in.